Namaskaram. My name is Sajin Harikumar from Kalari Club Dubai. Today we have a very special person in the house, Shifu Neil from the UK. So he is here in our Kalari to experience the ancient Indian art of Kalari practice. So Namaskaram, sir. So let's get started. Could you please introduce yourself? Hey, my name is Neil Genge. Um, I'm 63 years of age. I've been practicing martial arts for 50 years now. Uh, I run a Shaolin school in Bristol, in the southwest of the UK. Uh, I also teach Tai Chi and yoga. So that's my full time, full time job. So, uh, how did you discover Kalari Python? So, how did you? Is it a self research? Is it? I, I like the history of martial arts, and because I train in Shaolin, the, the story is of Bodhidharma, who came to Shaolin, and <laughs> you know meditated in the, the cave for all those years, and with him he brought yoga and Kalari, which he taught to the monks to stop their limbs from withering away because they'd sit in meditation for so long, they were getting very unfit. So he combined the, the martial arts of India and the, the basic martial arts of China to make Shaolin Kung Fu. So we've seen and we've heard stories, especially online in this age of internet, of the similarities between Kung Fu and Kalari Pai. So as a practitioner with all these years of experience and your training at Kalari Club Dubai, so what have you felt are like the major similarities between both these arts? It's very, very similar. The, the warm-up is the same, basically. Uh, the techniques, the forms, the, the, the sequences or patterns are very similar to the Shaolin Kung Fu forms. Also with the weapons, with the staff and the spear, uh, very, very same underlying principles are exactly the same. Um, it's good that in, especially in your school, you work on the combat applications of each move. So you're not just doing the movements, you're actually putting those movements into application. <laughs> 